everyone. Today we are learning about road transportation. What is a road? A road is a long piece of hard ground on land to help people get from one place to another. What is transportation? Transportation is the way that you can travel from one place to another. Now we are going to learn about different kinds of road transportation. I am going to say the word and I want you to say the word with me. Let's get started. Car. 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 A car is a road vehicle with typically four wheels and is able to carry a small number of people. The next word is truck. 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 A truck is a large vehicle used to transport large amounts of things. The next word is van. 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 A van is a medium sized vehicle used for transporting things or people. The next word is cyclo. 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 A cyclo is a three-wheeled vehicle which can be pedaled like a bicycle. The next word is bus. 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 A bus is a large vehicle carrying people by road. Usually the bus follows the same route and people have to pay money, a fee, to take the bus. The next word is bicycle, bicycle, bicycle. A bicycle is a two-wheeled vehicle that you sit on and is moved by turning the pedals with your feet. The next word is motorbike, motorbike, motorbike. A motorbike is a two-wheeled vehicle that is different than a bicycle because it is powered by an engine. We will learn about engines in a few minutes. The next word is scooter. 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 A scooter is a vehicle usually used just for fun. It has two small wheels and it has a place to rest your feet. You move forward by putting one foot on the footboard and pushing the other foot against the ground. These days, we also have something called an electric scooter. The electric scooter uses batteries and it does not require you to use your feet to move the scooter. The next word is Jeep. 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 A Jeep is a strong vehicle that can be used to travel over rough ground. The next word is skateboard. 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 A skateboard is a board with four small wheels. A person can move forward by occasionally putting one foot on the ground. Some people like to do tricks with a skateboard. These days, we also have something called an electric skateboard. An electric skateboard uses batteries and therefore does not require you to use your feet to move the skateboard. Now we are going to learn about one part of the vehicle. It is called the engine. What is an engine? 
It is a machine with moving parts that converts power into motion. An engine helps the vehicle to move. Not all forms of road transportation have an engine. So we are going to play a game. Can you guess which vehicle has an engine? I will give you a hint. When you look at the two vehicles, one vehicle can be moved just by moving your feet. That one does not have an engine. The other vehicle can't be moved just with your feet. That one does have an engine. Let's get started with the game. The first two vehicles are car and bicycle. Which one has an engine? And the answer is car. A car has an engine. This is a picture of a car engine. A bicycle does not have an engine because a bicycle can be moved by moving the pedals with your feet. The next two choices are cyclo and bus. Can you guess which one has an engine? And the answer is bus. A bus has an engine. This is a picture of a bus engine. The cyclo that we commonly use in Vietnam does not have an engine. A cyclo is very similar to a bicycle. The person who controls the cyclo has to move it by moving the pedals with their feet. This is the last one. Can you guess which one has an engine? A skateboard or a motorbike? And the answer is motorbike. A motorbike has an engine. This is a picture of a motorbike engine. The previous question was a bit of a trick question because these days we have something called an electric skateboard. An electric skateboard does not require you to move your feet to move the skateboard. Therefore, it does have an engine. But the traditional skateboards do require you to use your feet to move the skateboard. And those do not have an engine. I hope you enjoyed learning about road transportation and engines. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon. Bye.